Today, I'm talking about part 110, Dragon Beings, on a series titled, Non-Humans Are Everywhere. But first, let's see what the Word of God says. The Word of God says in Ephesians, the 6th chapter and the 12th verse 4, We wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Isaiah, the 27th chapter and the first verse says, In that day the Lord, with his sore and great and strong sword, shall punish Leviathan, the piercing serpent, even Leviathan, that crooked serpent, and he shall slay the dragon that is in the sea. Jeremiah, the 51st chapter and the 37th verse says, And Babylon shall become heaps, a dwelling place for dragons, and astonishment, and in hissing without an inhabitant. Psalms, the 74th chapter and the 13th verse says, Thou didst divide the sea by thy strength. Thou breakest the heads of the dragons in the waters. Psalms, the 91st chapter and the 13th verse says, Thou shalt tread upon the lion and adder, the young lion and the dragon shalt thou trample under feet. And Revelations, the 12th chapter and the 9th verse says, And the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil, and Satan, which deceived the whole world, he was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. Now, dragons are mythical monsters. They are giant reptiles, fire-breathing, and serpentine legendary creatures. You see, these mythical beings are usually represented as monstrous winged, crested-headed, enormous clawed, giant sea fish, and scaly serpents. And Unfortunately, these shape-shifting creatures from hell are everywhere. They are everywhere pretending to be humans. You see, in physical human-like form, these shape-shifting beings are wickedly powerful ancient dark forces. They are violent, combative, very strict, seriously harmful, bad, and very destructive beings. These baneful, non-human shape-shifting beings are sinister. They are hateful, poisonous, and causes injury, death, and ruin. Plus, dragons are filthy. They are filthy. They are heartless. They are vicious. They are damned. They are dinosaur-like abominations and cursed beings. You see... These bat winged, fire breathing, scaly lizards or snakes with a barred tail are real creatures from hell. They are devils. They are devils sent to earth on missions to destroy mankind. And draconic creatures appear virtually in all cultures around the globe. And there's all kinds of dragons because there's many different types of dragon beings. You see, these shape-shifting creatures are devils. They are demons. They are flying lizards and hybrid beings. And these dragon beings are false gods. They are monsters and dragon lords. Now, some dragons have wings and some don't. And some can speak or breathe fire and others can't. And some are only a few feet long, but some dragon spans miles and some dragons live in palaces under the ocean while others can be found inside mountains or caves and unfortunately unfortunately dragons exist and can take human form or disguise themselves as humans and dragons are here to pervert righteousness and to destroy mankind also dragons are pretending to be secret societies, the elite, globalists, singers, dancers, actors, models, 
sports stars, judges, politicians, news reporters, priests, clergy, cops, presidents, and regular citizens. So beware, 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 because dragons and their descendants are everywhere. They are everywhere throughout the world, but they can be defeated through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I am Prophetess Lorraine Daly Johnson. Thanks. Thanks for watching.